A wonderful scene here at Wembley. An ocean of fans descending upon the stadium for what promises to be an absolutely riveting FA Cup final. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live on EA TV. At long last, the wait is over. A warm welcome to Wembley. This is Derek Ray, joined in the commentary box by Stuart Robson. And we're approaching kickoff time in what promises to be a spectacular FA Cup final. It's Wolverhampton Wanderers taking on Liverpool. Well, Derek, as a youngster growing up, this was the day that every young footballer dreamt of. Playing in the FA Cup final, walking out in front of 100,000 fans at Wembley, broadcast around the world, it still brings a tingle to my spine. And I'm really looking forward to this one. The initial 11 for Wolves. Well, the 4-4-2 system relies on good combinations all over the pitch. The front two, the central midfield pairing, the full-back and winger, and, of course, the centre-backs. If you can get these combinations right, you'll have a good team. Alisson begins in goal. Andrew Robertson starts with Trent Alexander-Arnold in the fullback positions. And the job of lone striker in this game goes to Mohamed Salah. Johnny Hodge and Wolves in a position of menace Fabinho Darwin Nunez and continues his run but timely defending when it mattered Gonzalo Getsch Strength and control, a big part of his game. Opportunity! Oh, a goal for Liverpool! The first goal of this final, and how important could that be? Well, it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. So the ball moving again. Will there be a quick reply from Wolves? There needs to be. Ruben Neves. Can he finish? The importance of that tackle cannot be overstated. Alexander-Arnold. It's with Fabinho. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. And the pass could do damage. Oh, it almost did the trick for them. Great defending. Moving forward effectively. Salah. Well, here it is again, and the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against. And what a clever bit of play it is from Salah, both with his movement and his finish. That's a nice goal. So the ball rolling again at 2-0. Oh, nice ball over the top to Chase. The save was a good one.
trying to pick out a teammate and both hands on it good goalkeeping untidy on the ball well doesn't have to do it on his own oh in with a chance well what a stop that was Who's going to get on the end of it? It comes to absolutely nothing. Goalkeeper getting in the way. Superb save. <laughs> Trying to deliver it accurately. And a struggle to get it away properly. He's going forward well here. And options in the centre. Fabinho. Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Couldn't grab hold of it. And in it goes. From the goalkeeper's point of view, so disappointing. Well, when you look at this again, there's two things wrong defensively about this. First of all, the goalkeeper should not be parrying it into a dangerous area, and the defenders have to be sharper to get to the knockdown. It's not good defending all round. So back underway, and Liverpool really galloping to victory now. Jimenez. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Well, showing excellent vision. He's in behind the defence here. And tremendous goalkeeping. Well, he just made it so difficult for the striker. His presence alone just caused him a problem. Playing it in. Struggling to get it away. Splendid defending. Gonzalo Getsch. Well, this could pose problems for the defenders. And they couldn't quite muster a real threat. Well, taking into account all the stoppages, two minutes to be added on. Thiago. And with that, the first half comes to an end here at Wembley Stadium. So into the second half, and I must say it was a spellbinding performance by Liverpool in the first 45 here. Well, he's got plenty of space on the flank here. Giving it a try, and the keeper getting across to stop it. And they're making a change. <laughs> so the corner played into the box. Oh, a really good header. But the goalkeeper there's a cover-up. And another corner hot on the heels of the last one.
favouring the short one Henderson and here's Robertson Mo Salah will close down straight away and unable to keep possession Gonzalo Getsch can he find the right pass oh great vision being egged on by the crowd flinging himself at it the keeper well they are committed to making the substitution here Trying to pick out a teammate. Oh, good save. Excellent header. Well, another corner kick conceded. Let's see what they do this time. And the goalkeeper really exuding confidence. 30 minutes to go then. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Gonzalo Gedge. And here's Cunha. And making sure nothing untoward happened following the cross. No problems grabbing hold of that one. Raul Jimenez. An effective challenge. Well, as the stats confirm, Liverpool had the lion's share of the ball and they've made good use of it. They really have played some good attacking football and they look like scoring more. Twenty minutes to go in this one. Good-looking ball. Traore. On to Jimenez. Johnny. On to Neves. Determined defending. Neves, Jimenez. Oh, a vital piece of last ditch defending. Andrew Robertson. Darwin Nunez. Robertson. Well, couldn't quite find his teammate. A different option by moving in field. Firmino. Well, he couldn't worry the keeper with that effort. Mateus Cunha. Really a very poor ball. Darwin Nunez. Fabinho. Well, when you sit off like this, you invite pressure. Henderson and up for grabs off the keeper on a time for cool heads Ruben Neves Gonzalo Gens now bodies forward and the break looks on Johnny and Wolves will get the throw in and it is substitution time at this juncture, not just from one side, but from both. Well, the electronic board showing three additional minutes. Well, the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity.